welcome back to the channel. Today is a very exciting day. It is the day that we have been waiting for. Ipsy has announced the curator for their icon box for November 2023. If you're interested in finding out the details, then make sure you stick around. We're going to talk about it today. We're going to look at a few of the sneak peeks, just a few products that they have mentioned, go through them and talk about what we think and whether we are excited about who the curator is. All right, guys, so make sure you pop that subscribe button because I do a lot of beauty boxes on my channel. I tend to cover a lot of the spoilers, and I also do unboxings and try-ons, especially for Ipsy. I spend a lot of time on Ipsy here, so if that is something that you love and are always wanting to see what the spoilers are and scope out the boxes and, you know, different looks we can try with the products, then you'll want to stick around my channel. So let's go ahead and dig in and get to the exciting news. Okay. So you guys may have already seen it, and I'm not really giving you the big surprise, but some of you may not know who the curator is. And I also told you in my community tab, it was going to be announced today. I have pretty much dropped everything <laughs> to come make this video. I was like, oh, okay, it's out. We got to get this video to you guys. Um, so keep in mind that some things may even be updated after this video is complete. I have to film when I can film. So I'm hoping they don't drop even more info and I miss it, um, but I'm just giving you what I know to date right now to get it to you as soon as I can. So are you ready to hear who the curator is? We've all had some guesses. Ipsy had been dropping hints for the last couple months. The biggest hint they kind of gave was that it's going to be a makeup artist and everybody started inquiring after that and threw out some names. The name that they did continue to go back to a lot was that of Pat McGrath. And indeed, turns out that they were correct. It is the legendary Pat McGrath. I am so excited about this. Are you guys? Um, so if you don't know Pat McGrath, um, you know, as they said, she is a makeup artist. She has been in the industry for, you know, over 20 years designing such quality palettes and makeup. I've only recently even started trying out her products, but I have been in love with everything I've tried. She makes the very popular Mothership palettes that just have this very unique formula. I still do not own one, <laughs> but I know all about her. Um, I own other ones by her and other products by her. Um, her products are just are super luxury, high quality, very popular. She is an icon. So I think she is perfect for the name of the box, which is Icon Box. Some other things about her, she's actually worked a lot on, you know, celebrity, like photo shoots, editorials, a lot of Hollywood faces, including Taylor Swift. She was responsible for the Bejeweled look in Taylor Swift's um, music video. And also Zoe Kravitz um, transformed her into Catwoman, basically. And Ipsy's kind of told us a little bit about this in their intro. She's also um, is an actual Barbie doll. They have a Pat McGrath Barbie doll out there from 2021. And she's even been knighted by Queen Elizabeth II. How cool is that? So, however, sometimes even you get excited about who it is, but it really is all about the products. So, um, let's see what kind of products might be curated for us in the icon box before we get too excited. So I do have about five products that um, Ipsy has given us a sneak peek about that could end up in the icon box, but I'm sure there's going to be many more they add. This is just the very beginning, guys. This is just all that I know for right now, okay? Um, there's also some other ones in addition to this, and we'll talk about that in a minute, but I'm going to go ahead and go through this list of um, the five items that Ipsy gave us a little spoiler sneak peek at. And we'll talk about it. So the first one is the Pat McGrath Labs Divine Rose Lux Quad. The Eternal Eden um, is the quad. Uh, basically a rose inspired um, color story. And this is a very like silky formula. You have a mix of mattes and shimmers in it. Oh my goodness. Super excited to get this. Now it's not a mothership. However, I'm thinking, is this still part of that last collection she did? Um, I actually covered it in a video a while ago when she was coming out with all her bronzers. 
Um, I'm thinking this might have been one of them, but I'll double check that for you and let you know. Okay, I checked and it's not the same one that was in the bronzer collection and the same bronzer collection, but it's very similar because that one was called the Venetian bronze or something like that. This is just a different color shade story, but very similar idea. So still very exciting. I would absolutely love to get it. And this is the kind of color story I love. I love the roses and the pinks. Definitely a great color story for my liking. So this retails normally for $62. So even being a quad, it is a very high end quad. All right. And then we've also got her uh, Pat McGrath Labs Dark Star Mascara in Extreme Black. This retails for $34. It's supposed to volumize and lift and lengthen. And then we also have lipstick. So this is Pat McGrath Labs Trance Lipstick in the shade Elson. So this is a full-on bright red lipstick shade. It's going to be like bullet style. It is oil infused is the, uh, the texture. Um, definitely she's known for her lipsticks too. So that's actually very exciting. Um, I don't know about shade ranges if it's just going to be this shade for good or if you're possibly in the future, if they'll offer more shades. Um, but for right now they're saying this shade Elson. So that's all of the makeup and that's everything that we're seeing from Pat McGrath labs um, herself. Her brand is Pat McGrath, Pat McGrath Labs. So those are the three we're seeing straight from her um, that are, you know, in their makeup. We've got a couple others, and I think these are her picks also, but they're other brands. So these include, one is the Herbivore Botanicals Supernova 5% Vitamin C plus Caffeine Brightening Eye Cream. You knew we were going to get some skincare in there, guys. It's not Ipsy if you're not going to get some skincare. I mean, you know, you want to mix, you know, and they do give you like a mix. Um, so, um, you know, good brand. And we see Herbivore sometimes. But definitely, it's the skincare and a little bit about it. It retails for $48. So another, you know, power pick probably. Um, and it's going to include, like it says, vitamin C. But also... Um, Turmeric is also in it, which is like, you know, brightening. It has antioxidants. It's going to be um, designed to help with depuffing, you know, dark circles under the eyes and brightening them and everything like that. Okay, another pick is Murad, which is another great skincare. This is the Rapid Collagen Infusion, and it retails for $89. So again, power picks here that we're looking at. This is a more of a treatment and it's going to have like a filler effect, very plumping, smoothing on the surface of the skin, supposed to kind of help give you radiance and glow. Again, Murad is very good, but so you've got a couple of skincare options and then three makeup. Those are the five items that Ipsy's sharing right now of what we might see that are curated uh, by Pat McGrath. However, they did say that there's a few other favorite brands of hers that might show up as well. And these got me very excited because they're my favorite brands as well. And those include Tatcha, Drunk Elephant, and Laura Mercier. So they haven't told us about those products yet, but if I see any of those names show up, I'm going to get very excited too. So, so far, this is super promising in my opinion. Now, we're not seeing a mothership, um, but we've got some Pat McGrath makeup. So that's very exciting to me. We have gotten a few items from Pat McGrath in our icon boxes before in the past, or was it Boxy? One of the two. And I got so excited. It was like within the last year that I think I started seeing her. Um, so we have gotten a few things and I was beyond happy with uh, Ipsy for this. So I'm like, bring it on, bring it on. That's everything. What do you guys think? I am thrilled. I am over the moon. I am super excited about it. Um, I'm hoping very much though that, you know, we're going to see some of these picks from her favorite brands like me and that we'll see even more from her because those were the three items from Pat McGrath Labs. Those were the only three that they um, have given us a sneak peek on. I'm hoping we see more than that. Come on, Ipsy. All right, guys, that wraps it up. Super excited. Stay tuned in case there's any more news. I will bring it to you as soon as I hear it. Stay um, watching my community tab as well in case I post it more in a post, keeping you guys updated or, um, you know, a video like this. You know, I don't know which, but just kind of watch out everywhere. Make sure you turn the notification bells to on and pop the subscribe so that you stay in the loop. 
And I will also be bringing you the regular spoilers for BoxyCharm and Glam Bag as soon as I see them too. Um, but today was all about the Icon Box. All right, guys. So I'll see you on the next one and take care.